an armed woman shot dead at Indonesia's National Police Headquarters Wednesday was an Islamic State sympathizer. Authorities said, citing social media posts she made shortly before the fatal gun battle. Kurang lebih jam 16.30 tadi, ada seorang wanita yang berjalan masuk dari uh, pintu belakang, kemudian uh, yang bersangkutan kemudian mengarah ke pos gerbang utama yang ada di yang bersangkutan kembali dan kemudian melakukan penyerangan terhadap anggota yang ada di pos jaga dengan melakukan penembakan sebanyak enam kali yang bersangkutan ini adalah tersangka atau pelaku lone wolf yang berideologi radikal ISIS yang dibuktikan dengan postingan yang bersangkutan di sosial media. On Wednesday afternoon, the 25-year-old woman wearing a niqab face veil and a long black gown entered the police complex in downtown Jakarta and opened fire on officers at the entrance, authorities said. Images broadcast by local media showed the woman fall to the ground as shots rang out before lying motionless as police surrounded her body. Authorities said they had identified the woman as a university dropout who had left a suicide note at her family home in Jakarta, which they raided after the shootout. She had posted the IS flag and writings about becoming a martyr on a recently created Instagram account. The attack came after the arrest of dozens of suspected militants in recent months by Indonesia's counter-terror squad. Indonesia's security forces regularly arrest suspected militants and attacks have often been low level and have targeted domestic security forces. Indonesia has been on high alert in recent days after two suicide bombers, alleged members of a pro-ISIS extremist group, blew themselves up at a church in Makassar City on Sulawesi Island, wounding about 20 people. Police outposts have been frequent targets of Indonesian extremists in the past. The Philippines today